internet! I'm Hamster Bomb, and you are watching some more Metal Gear Solid 5. And we are going to be moving on to our brand new mission we just got in the last episode, which is Proxy War Without End. The CFA are gearing up for a large-scale attack against Angola's MPLA government. They're assembling an armored column to the north of Nova Braga Airport, and will be ready to move soon. <laughs> We've been contracted by the MPLA to put a stop to them. <laughs> But the civil war will keep burning on, whether we accept this job or not. Another east-west proxy war with the communist MPLA on one side, and the capitalist-funded CFA on the other. An endless seesaw of blood and violence played out in the hands of the superpowers. I had my doubts at first, but I think we should take this job. Skullface is gone, but Cypher still remains. Competition with rival PFs will only get more intense. For us to survive, we need to expand our organization and get strong enough that no one can threaten us. So our only option is to fight and grow and fight and grow. Okay, man, I see. Um, but I gotta say, looks like I get a new blueprint in this one if I can find it. And um, I'm thinking that might be my last one. I thought I had a flamethrower one, but that might be my last blueprint, which would be awesome. Proxy war Mission accepted. without end. Um... I'm gonna assume I want to land right in the middle. Uh, heading to Central Africa. So I'm not entirely sure where we're heading right now. Oh, sure. Whatever I equipped it that was better. Absolutely yes. But here's the thing. I'm thinking we still need the power. I don't know how much power, but we need some serious power. Now, is that mean this rocket, or like this big honking mama that I love, or, hmm, I don't know. I don't know, because I, I think we need rockets for this time. He mentioned there's like serious, uh, serious stuff in this one. I'm expecting we're taking out tanks and choppers. Oh boy. Um, for that, I definitely want to bring quiet. Man, this one's like a homing one. It shoots multiples. Yeah, it saved me in the past. I love that thing. So, um, this though, are we going stealthy and then I'm, yeah, I'm going to go stealthy, but if I need it, I got this, which means I actually am set with everything else that I've got, which is kind of frightening. Um, items and tools, everything, I'm just going to keep it as is, uh, quiet, I don't think I'm going to switch you on anything, just knock them out, knock them dead. Vehicle, I could bring a tank and just be awesome. I've never done that yet. I've been considering doing it, but I'm still trying to at least be a little quiet and stealthy here. Maybe. Just a little bit. I'm trying. I'm trying. Can't fault me for trying, right? I mean, hey, I got S ranks on some of the recent ones we were doing, right? I mean, it's not bad. That's not bad at all. The only thing is, um, I need a rocket launcher this time, I'm pretty sure. I got a feeling there's gonna be too many of these gunships like okay this is I'm getting in the middle of two warring parties again this is like Metal Gear 4's beginning all over again and everyone's gonna be like look a random old man kill him the CFA are assembling an armored column to the north of Nova Braga airport north of Nova Braga okay to wipe them out listen to the tape for the contract details just be aware that the column's commander served with five commando Later made a name for himself in South Africa's 32 Battalion. Yeah. So don't take him lightly. Boss, I have a report from the intel team. The targets are now on the move. I've sent their predicted route to your iDroid. Oh no. Check your app. This is just like back up, back down, isn't it? This is basically back up, back down again. Yikes. Um, they are converging on me, I believe. Which, that's good. Sheesh. Oh, this is frightening. So quiet. I honestly don't know what you're gonna do. How do I get to the road here? Actually, it's just straight away. Um, I could blow them up. I mean, that's my mission. They didn't tell me to... No one said there were gonna be survivors. But... Thing is, I mean, oh gee, oh jeez, they're coming already. Um, 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 um. Ooh, ooh, 
Oh! Ah! Ah! One. Oh God! Get off the road! Uh oh! I can't even see it. Where is it? Okay, it's right there. Ready? It's a uh, Y, I think. Here we go. This better work. If not, I'm switching immediately. Oh, that's two tanks, heavily armored vehicles, and I am not even hidden well. This is stupid. This is really stupid. Hi! Boss, we have your targets. Check your iDroid for the details. No, just this one, just you. Yeah! What could have done that? I know, right? Oh, he's smoking. Oh, no. You see nothing. You see nothing. Maybe I can still get behind him and steal him. Rain's cool. Jeez Louise. Okay. Come on. Be my friend. Don't keep going. Yes, mine. Okay. Got one. That's good. There's a total of five, they say. He's coming too. We loaded? Lock and loaded, son. All right. Got another one. So Wait, what's this one mean? What's that? Why is that yellow? Why is that yellow? Why is that freaking yellow? What is that? Hi! Oh, because it got there already? Well, snap. Snap, son. Excuse me, goats. Lots of goats today. Um, hey, quiet, you know, do a thing. Um, attack this place, just from here, just do stuff. Just start going. Go for it. I don't even care who you shoot, how you shoot him, just do it. You know what she should do? What she should do? Um, wait a minute, scout the area first. Guy won't see me, right? Right, guy won't see me. Guy won't see me. They didn't even know that their stuff's gone. Their people are gone. Rain's a coming. Dude, you are such a bad guard. You are such a bad guard. I will not fault in you. No. You're horrible. You're terrible. You're all terrible. Come on, I got another guy here. Thank you. I don't care about uh, anything specific about you guys just yet. Now we see that thing out there. Quiet. What are you doing? What? Oh, she's out there. Oh, shoot. That was dumb. Scout, um, this place. They're all pl Oh, they're not! She's right, they're not! They're not converging here! I gotta get all the way out there. I'm gonna run really far away on the side, just so I can go quicker. Gotta get out there, gotta steal that thing. Oh, that's the wrong outpost. That was the wrong outpost. Oh no, that was the wrong outpost. I gotta send her elsewhere. She's just gonna cause problems. This one's mine though. Don't take this from- oh god, that guy's gonna look right at me as I take it. What caused that? I don't know. Dude, what are you talking about? Dude, what are you talking about? There's nothing there. Don't be crazy, dude. All right, uh, quiet. Never mind. I told you to go to the wrong place. I'm an idiot. I'm aware. I, I understand. You can call me that. I'm stupid. I get it. Don't even start it. Oh, she did. There's even goodies over there too. And uh, I mean, I love me a good pack of good. Uh, gu 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 gu. Yep, gunship. Friggin' gunship. Knew it. I got a friggin' gunship. Of course. Of course. I'm good though. I can do this. Uh oh. Can I take him now? A little too far away. A little too far away. Um, how about get it before it's gonna make. Yeah, I see it. Don't try to take down a gunship from the front. You won't win in a head to head shoot. Oh, you wanna bet? Oh, I'm getting it. I've got this. It's. It's actually quite large. I'm good. 
Just in case, I'm gonna load some more. All of those. You're gonna survive all of those? That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Uh -oh. You ain't coming to me, are you? Oh dear. It's going to them. I can do that. Okay, cool. We're locked and loaded. Ready to go. Quiet. Let's start our onslaught. Go for it. Yeah. The only thing is I accidentally sent them on alert by taking that, um... That thing down. And I did go into a reflex mode, which means my perfect stealth score is already gone. It's okay, though. I'm more interested... Let's find those blueprints while we're here. Um... I'm gonna try and snag that thing. Looks like there's only one guy left. See him right there? That's one dude. And a tank. One dude and a tank. That's it. In fact... Uh-oh. Tank's moving. If that tank sees quiet, we're screwed. If that tank sees quiet... Uh-oh. Where's it going? Where's it going? Nope. You aren't getting away... Thought he was trying to retreat. That's not happening. That is not happening. Okay, come on now. Come on. Come on now. I can do this. I can do this. Get behind it. If it sees me, we're done. Nice. It's moving. No. Get back here. Don't make me shoot you. Don't make me shoot you! Oh dear. I think I gotta shoot it. Woo! What is he doing? What is this guy doing? He's just like, ah, get away! There's a snakey poo after me! And he's right. You know what? Um, screw it. No. No, I hit the tree. Oh gosh. I hit the tree. Now nah, he's on fire. Screw it. He's on fire. He's done. Going back. What are my other objectives? There's other stuff. Nice. I can, but there's also that place back here with so many goodies. And they said there was also like a commander or something like that to take to. Um, and blueprints. I want the blueprints. There was also like so many things to steal in that other place. Like, gimme, gimme. Man, these missions nowadays are not bad when I got nice rocket launchers and quiet. You just win. That's the game. You just win. Um, now one of these guys is going to be Analysis my man, isn't he? I would hope so. Or no, they said Nova Braga. Analysis they didn't even get to Nova Braga, did they? The airport. Uh, uh, see if I soldier. I don't know which one's actually our, our man here. Do we have blueprints anywhere? Blueprints built. Yeah! Wait, wait, what's this? Look at Snake! Oh my god! Snake! Jesus! Look at it! <laughs> Look at it! What are you doing? What was that? Did he look at it? I don't know what he did. He's just being stupid. He's being so stupid. I was pushing it. I was. I thought that was the blueprints. I mean, I got it, didn't I? Snake wanted to be too dumb. Being too dumb. Be like, what blueprints? I don't see anything here. What are you talking about? Oh my god, the intel thing's right there. It's like telling me where to go. What? What's the deal? What does this mean? What does that mean? I'm pushing Y. I'm pushing Y, game. All right. So, I want a chopper. Pick me up, please. Let's get out of here. Because I don't know what the heck this is about. See ya. Couldn't find my blueprints and, uh... Couldn't find, um, any commander. But whatever. Mind if I get in and out really quickly? Maybe I'll still get my S rank? Who knows? Probably not. Speed is probably all you need for these S ranks. Wow, I, uh. 
I'll get rid of it. It's expensive, but get down here. Come on, Peaky. How can she aim through that? I have no idea. Ridiculous. Actually, I should have taken my car and just driven out. I uh, just like the chopper exit. It's a little bit more fun. You know what I mean. You know what I'm saying. Yep. Winner. W winner, winner, chicken dinner. Should have, um, should have probably drove my way out of there. Extraction arrived. Got more people on accident. Well. Oh, I did it anyway. I was even standing there like a dingus, like, what on earth is this? Yeah, there was an enemy alert. That stunk. How did I still get an S rank? They're getting so easy to get. Like, I got, I had to use a reflex. I got an alert, and uh, I don't know. My accuracy wasn't even per. Well, it's because that homing missile hit the tree. Can't do anything about that. Um, yeah, it was pretty expensive, but um, I'm good. We still made Mooney. Still made the Mooney. Rewards, um, more hamburgers of Godzilla and Skull Faces Objective Five. Okay, so if any of those are yellow, we will listen to them. A legendary soldier. Uh, I extracted somebody? Yeah, I don't even remember. I, I guess I did. I should have extracted probably a lot more. As we suspected, the mastermind behind the kid's escape was Eli. No duh. It's hard to believe. No, Apparently, it's not. He'd been plotting an armed uprising against us. That's not surprising. He could be hiding something else too. Uh, he probably is. Oh, gonna press him for answers. Oh, good. Back as quick as you can. I'm. Oh. 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 Cutscene. Finally. I want to watch Eli get tortured. That sounds fun. By Revolver Ocelot. That sounds fun. Can we see this, please? Like, see? Oh, yep. That's so happening right now. Virus. I told you, your father's not here. <clears throat> they're back. Yes, they're back. But don't get any bright ideas. The quarters are under full surveillance. Your weapons privileges have been suspended. No more uprisings for you. Oh. Do you really think it would be that easy, Commander? You'll get your boys back. They'll even see the boss, too. First, I need to know what you sent them to do. <clears throat> they wanted to leave. To their homelands. They wanted to go home. That's all. So they were just homesick then? Not quite. <laughs> Militia warlords, PFs, the armies that murdered their families. Cousins, brothers, parents. They all had someone they wanted to kill. <laughs> I told them. Last chance to face the world with no regrets. Last chance. You better be ready for your drag back here. Ready to face the world as enemies. <laughs> no! Oh! What? Oh, son of a... Okay. Huh? Huh? Oh boy, yep. Guess I'm not surprised there. He wanted to steal my metal gear. Um. Oh! You. Goodbye, father. I don't need you anymore. Oh, so Eli, he very much knows what? What? Oh, the kids stole the Metal Gear. 
Was Ralph really an accident? Or did Eli just rig it to stir up the boys? Either way, he had to have been planning for this all along. Bidding farewell to the world. Uh, Children's Escape 6. We got a little time, we'll listen to that too. Praying Man, oh, that's cool. It's from 4. Um, so I'm assuming we're gonna have to challenge them and take it back or destroy it. Boss, we're looking for the kids in Sohalanthropus, but there's still no sign of them. We don't know if the chopper pilot is alive either. Oh. What have we gone and put in the hands of those kids? We don't know how bad this is until we find them. Also, regarding our concerns about Eli, mm -hmm. I finished looking into whether or not he's a product of that project. No, duh! I have an answer. He said so! On tape. Give it a listen. Oh, good. Well, at the very least, we can listen to it. I enjoy just listening to it. I'd rather, of course, watch cutscenes. I mean, I was really excited. Received some new job offers. Of course. The details are on your iDroid. We always have new job offers. This one's yellow, though. Skull faces objective. Though this is actually really short. Ocelot's fears. Let's listen to. Okay, not the hamburger thing. They're really hilarious. Listen to them offline. But this is main story stuff. You know, it sounds like. Back all the child soldiers who escaped. Eli knew they'd returned. Needless to say, nobody said a word to him. I guess they got a message to him somehow. Oh. Eli wasn't put in the corner in time out. He was locked up in that room, completely cut off from the outside world. It's a psycho man. It's only one possibility I can think of. The Soviet Union has been researching military applications for psi phenomena. Psi? Things like psychokinesis and ESP, extrasensory perception. You mean moving objects without touching them, knowing what card somebody's holding up. Psychic powers? Come on. I thought that was just another bunch of disinformation aimed at the West. Just bear with me a second. One type of ESP is telepathy. It's the ability to know another person's thoughts through nonverbal means. You're saying Eli read our minds? It's the only idea that doesn't involve someone getting to him. <sighs> Ocelot. Look, Psy research isn't some hocus pocus. It's all evidence-based, scientific. There's got to be another explanation. Maybe one of the kids stuck a note to your back. <laughs> I hope that's the case. But I am convinced that they have, or Eli has, a connection to some force we have yet to identify. You better watch yourself, boss. How am I supposed to do that? If he is depending on something for help, well, that's his Achilles heel. If you can figure out what that something is, you might be able to use it against him. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, and the medical team is looking after the kids left on Mother Base. For the moment, they don't seem too panicked. But boss, get this. Eli got those kids to plot their armed uprising as a diversion. Also, he could steal Sahalanthropus and escape. That brat got us good. Set us up and knocked us down. And then there's that mystery kid who was with Eli. With those two working together, I'd say things won't be over for a long time yet. It's actually not the uh, uh, recording I was thinking he was going to talk about. It's probably this yellow one up here. But, I gotta say, um, what's weird about this, why well, I keep going like, oh, come on, I know, is normally whenever Metal Gear, like, teases you with stuff like that, like, but what could they be doing? What is this mysterious stuff? What are they doing? What's going on? Me, the player, normally never knows, and I'm like, I don't know, and I can relate to Snake's ignorance and confusion in the matter, but in this Metal Gear alone, it's, I don't think it's happened in any other one, I know everything. They showed us in cutscene. We already know these characters. We know what's happening. So it's not surprising. But they are unsure about it. But me, the player, isn't. And I, that, it's a disconnect. I hope that's clear. Skullface. Real name unknown. Born in Hungary. More specifically, northern Transylvania after it reverted to Hungary from Romania. While he was young, the country allied with Germany as part of the Axis powers. But later during the war, it came under Soviet occupation. The Hungarians struggled for independence, but the Soviets came down. Hard. Yeah. Just like he said, time and again, the country was ruled by a foreign tongue. When he was a young boy, he lost his native language. The bedrock for any developing child. Mm. 
His country, his family, his face, his identity, everything was stolen from him. All he had left was his skull. Skullface first tried his hand at espionage during all the chaos from the war. Agents, military officials, and soldiers who operated out of Hungary during the war vanished over the course of several months. This Soviet spy hunt rocked the counter-intel world. Mysterious fatal illnesses, accidental deaths, drownings, people having strokes behind closed doors. Just like Stalin, no one knew who was behind it. But all you need to do was look for who had the motive. They were all taken out by a man without a face. And now we've got an idea of how he did it, too. He'd gotten revenge for his people, but he wasn't finished. Skullface defected to the West, eventually ended up with the SAS. That's where he met Zero. It's possible he began planning this whole thing back then. It's hard to say. In any case, Zero made him his XO. He always did have a thing for oddballs. But this one was set to lead a unit no one else would know about. When Zero created Fox, he also formed XOF as a support team. An unconventional special forces unit designed to support Fox, make it stronger. With Skullface given the orders. Zero never even told the boss about it. Nor the CIA, naturally. If Fox was Zero's silver bullet, XOF was the recoil when he pulled the trigger. Just like Newton's third law. While you were with Fox, Skullface was operating behind the scenes. Sometimes as your backup, sometimes as a mole or a scout, sometimes as your cleanup crew. Fox's tail, making sure the mission succeeded and that you survived. We only have his word to go on, but Skullface's goal was revenge against those who'd use language to subjugate people. Those corrupting a people's identity by forcing a new tongue on them. Those using the power of language to control information. Naturally, that set his sights on Zero. To Zero, English was simply the most convenient code. But to Skullface, English was a parasite. And by eradicating it, he'd stop the world from being eaten away. If that didn't work, he was ready to see the world scorched by nuclear fire. To save language, culture, and race from annihilation, he was willing to overstep the hands of the doomsday clock. That is, of course, if you believe anything he had to say. Which, I don't. He's just a crazy man. I mean, like, I understand why he is the way he is. Kind of, a, he has an extreme response to what happened, but still, pretty ridiculous. Ah, there is a yellow one in here. The White Mamba 3 Eli's DNA test. That's what I was looking for. Boss, we've got the results of Eli's genetic test. We know the answers, though. finally put this worry behind us. We used the PCR technique and conducted DNA fingerprinting of the copied DNA sequences. Neither is mainstream science yet, but the concepts and procedures are sound. Both tests say there is 0% chance that the two of you are blood relatives, meaning the results are negative. Really? He's not your son, nor is he your clone. He's just another person. It was 12 years ago that Zero made plans to clone you. Eli's age and appearance certainly are a good fit. I admit the first time I saw him, I did a double take. But it looks like we were worried for nothing. Eli isn't your clone. But you might still have one somewhere out there. But if Eli isn't the boss's clone, why does he seem so obsessed with him? Not to mention having one hell of an attitude for his age. <laughs> I don't know. Learning the truth about himself, cursing the fact he's a clone, bearing a grudge against selfish adults, and coming to hate who he was cloned from. Big boss. If that were really the case, I could understand it. I might even feel a bit sorry for him. <sighs> but no clone could have a totally different DNA fingerprint. And the test left no room for error. You yourself were there when we drew Eli's blood sample. Come to think of it, when we went to OKB Zero, he'd snuck onto a chopper and was there. Yeah. He was acting strange even then. 
or actually from a little before that time. That was exactly when we began these tests. Maybe he suspected something when we drew the sample, not knowing what we were doing to him, and becoming mistrustful of us. Hard to say. Eli's had an attitude problem from day one. So what is he then? Well, if he's gonna tell us that himself, we'll need to get him to open up more first. Interesting. He's still liquid, for sure. But why is he not a clone? Why is he not a clone? That is interesting. I wonder if he would have done what he had done had he had known that. Or if our test is accurate. Either way, I don't know. A lot of weird stuff going on. I'm sure there's going to be a lot more coming up in the future. Who keeps putting this poster up? For crying out loud, at least it gives me GMP for taking it down. But, I don't know. Big Boss posters only. Big Boss is watching you. And that's all you need to know about Pink Horse. Welcome to Pink Horse, where Big Boss is watching you. But either way, that was really cool. I actually have no idea what our next missions are, so I kind of want to check them out in the Aerial Command Center. If it'll let me get in there, please. Uh, Big Rod! Let's go, Big Rod. I got stuff I want to do. I want to check out what we're going to be doing in the next episode. As far as I know, we did our last yellow mission, and uh, right now I'm... I'm all story right now. I just want to finish. I'm so excited. Then and um, I'll know that, you know, it's a bunch of things when finishing a Let's Play series. I'm like, I really want to get to that point. Plus, uh, then if I do um, live streams and stuff with you guys, I can do all the other stuff, you know, on streams, if you guys want to, if you're up for it. Uh, which, by the way, if you guys want to see streams of Metal Gear Solid where I do all that kind of stuff, you need to vote for it on my Twitter page. I let you guys vote all the time. Um, every week, actually, on what we're gonna stream that week. Metal Gear is always an option, um, but it's gotta get voted for. So, just throwing that out there. We do do that stuff, and there actually were, obviously, a few streams that I mentioned before. I said, like, oh, I'm streaming this episode. You can watch the whole streams. They're on my channel still. But anyway, we gotta check this out. I'm pretty sure they're gonna tell me about some new job offers or something along those lines, and then we're gonna be ready to move on. Yep, yellow. Got it, whatever it is. Yeah. It was Emmerich. What? He used the kids in the staff living quarters to carry out his repairs. What? We got the details on tape. You're gonna wanna hear this. What? Why didn't you get the details in a cutscene? Um, unfortunately I didn't listen to that hamburger thing. I'm doing that offline, I'm sorry. Cooperating with Eli. There's more. What was your goal in having the children repair Sahelanthropus? I just answered their questions. I had no idea they would actually try to fix it. I mean, can you imagine a child piloting it? Oh, sure. Easily. It wouldn't work. Well, I bet it's just like riding a bike. I said it didn't work. It... Who did you try? I, I didn't. Did you put your son in it? Uh, we never did that. His name was, uh, Hal, wasn't it? I, I thought you said you never saw his face. But you made him pilot Sahelanthropus. You used him in your experiments. He wanted to get in. <sighs> it was such a short time we had. So he was with you. We were happy. You're still happy now. Changing your lies to suit the listener and getting by slipping through the cracks. Building layer upon layer of convenient stories until nothing means anything to you anymore. You're happy all the time because you don't even notice you're doing it. Think hard. Who are you really? You're not a victim and you're not the silent majority. You're a perpetrator and a petty hypocrite. The real world doesn't make you suffer. It's the other way around. Oh my. Oh my! He actually had something to do with that. Really now? I have nothing yellow. Please select a mission. Maybe you have to do some of these, uh, do some more of them in order to unlock more yellow stuff? I don't know. I actually don't know. Now I have no yellow side ops. These are yellow, but it's just because of um, the challenge tasks of stuff that I've done. Um, now what's really concerning me... What do I do in another episode? How do I get more cutscenes? 
I'm gonna attempt this. I'm gonna land again. Do I trigger a new video? Because if not, I don't know what, um... Maybe I need to do a side up and come back? I don't know. But if this doesn't do anything... Ah... Uh, this is my first point in the whole game with no directive. And... Is that... That can't be the end, you know, there's, there's gotta be more, but... I'll have faith in the game. Clearly, it's going somewhere. It's trying to. I know, like I said at one point, Kojima obviously gets kicked out of the office and this game gets shut down. Um, I'm kind of expecting that. That's why I'm trying to be satisfied with what little we have for, in terms of story, but, uh, you know, it still, it still hurts. Checkpoint. Why a checkpoint? Why a checkpoint? Darn it! No, it's nothing. Boss, I've updated the mission list. Ah. Uh, We've received some new job offers. Why didn't you say that earlier? Alright, so we're going to take a look at whatever the heck those new missions are in the next episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Remember to like the videos and subscribe for more. And I will see you all in the next episode of Metal Gear Solid 5. Boo you.